Hello, happy Sunday. Hey guys, happy <laughs> Sunday. Welcome to Sunday Eats and Treats. Yeah, we are excited about making this one because you see we can make it really fast and just eat it right now. Yep. We don't have to bake it, we don't have to cook it or freeze it or anything. We can eat it right away That's and so good. can you when you make it. So hopefully it's good though. Yep. <laughs> so I posted like it's the um, dessert, the fruit dessert. You probably have seen a fruit pizza and the fruit pizza is made with this white flour and I think even some nuts and stuff and butter and all that. Well, guess what? I posted what this was and it wasn't made with any grain. So no flour, no wheat, no anything. It's actually made with dates. So Yum. we've got dates here that I soaked for about 10 minutes and then um, I cut them in half. And I get them at the bulk um, set, uh, bulk section at um, Winco. At Winco. Um, so that's what's in here. And then, go ahead. And I just gotta say about dates. Before we started Sunday Eats and Treats, I had never tried dates. And so that's been one of the fun things as we've been doing this journey is we're exploring new foods. Right. And I actually like dates and some of the recipes that we've made, so. Yeah, yeah, for sure. Hey, Ethan, hi. Okay, what I actually I'm like figuring I've got Instagram over here and Facebook over yes, here. Yes, so we sorry. do. Yep. I'm trying to look. I'm That's okay. You're doing perfect. Direction. I haven't lined up perfect, so you're hey, good. Hey, buddy. So. Oh, good to hey. Sometime we are gonna have to come to Cali, or you're gonna have to come to Idaho. Okay. That's right. Alrighty. So. <laughs> That's my nephew. Yes, it is. Love him. Love him. And then we have one and a half cups of cashews. So we soak these first, and then all we have to do is put them in the blender. We're gonna do that right now. Okay. Super easy. Okay, and then, yep, you want to push some of those down. I will. Let me get my red spatula. There you go. They're all the way to the bottom. Okay. I just had to shake the ninja. Okay, so we're going to pulse this. We're not going to like... Okay. Uh, yeah. So, it's supposed to be kind of noisy. Now, so, so it's supposed to with the nuts um, because there's oil natural oil in the nuts it's supposed to just um, help it gel together so who do I got here hey there right. I'm sorry I'm having a hard time reading that is uh, I can't see either um, that is Demi Ellison Tampa. yeah Hi. Well, welcome Enjoy. you're in the, you're in Nampa so you should just come over you should <laughs> Totally. <laughs> Can you believe it though? It's like, what, 80 degrees right now? It's a beautiful day. Instead so. of the 101 we've been having? Yeah, it's been awesome. Yesterday we went out with the kids on the Let boat. Let me get this. Go ahead, you talk about that. Went out with the kids on the boat and Judy, anytime we go out on the boat, she invites everybody and their grandma. And so you get, you never know who's going to show up and it's always a great, great time. So we had a bunch of kids on the boat, Bridget and Molly and uh so you also said taylor the lampsons came out and we just had a great time and then we even took some of the parents out amy garner uh, sorry not amy uh, i forgot hey, about right. elia and then jeremiah and uh melissa lampson we had okay, a whole I'm going group to, to, all right yeah. so so hang on i think it's done it's done <laughs> Because it's just stuck and it's not going any further. Yep. And you know what we're going to do? This is the crust. So the nice thing about this, oh, sorry. The nice thing about this is it doesn't matter um, how well blended it is. Let me just check this out. That's good. I was about to take it out before we tried it one more time. He's saying but, that, but I'm like yeah. thinking about it. So um, what we're going to do is we're going to place it in here. So while I'm doing this part. Okay. Let's talk about what we've been doing so, what, with our kiddos. Yeah, so what yesterday started was we have two weeks left of school. And two so, weeks left of summer. Well, until school, that's right. Two weeks left until summer's over and school starts. Until school. But on, honestly, <laughs> actually, because we have kids in two different schools, so we've got a week with one of them and two weeks with the other. So yeah. right now we've got two uh, one week. we'll say a week so we decided to do a family staycation in the last couple weeks here and so last sunday we met with the kids and we said all right we have two weeks but we, we can't take two weeks off because we have volleyball tryouts and we have work and all kind of different things and we're like you know what? we need to print plan with purpose some activities for our family to close out the summer so we went to them and we said, hey, all right, kids, if you could do anything, what would you like to do? So, of course, Judy and I 
the biggest kids of all want to go out on the boat. So that's what we did yesterday. So today we're actually having a movie marathon and that was Jessica's idea. Yeah. So we're actually uh, watching Woodlawn, Forever, or My Girl, and uh, Wrinkle in Time. And that was Jessica's idea. That was awesome. And uh, so we're right in the middle of that. So we've taken a little break so that we can do Sunday Eats and Treats. And we've got a dessert made. And so She and wants then, Sundays, so we're going to do that too. But we've got this dessert made, and it's a healthy dessert, so no guilt involved. Yay! Yay! <laughs> and we did get the ice cream and Sunday toppings for the kids because that's what, what Jessica wanted. And she asked that I make homemade pizza. So I actually have homemade pizza crust rising as we speak. Okay. And then Ashton wants to do something. He wants to go to the... <laughs> he just wants to go to a hotel and, and play fun. games. And play games and swim. And play in the pool. Yeah, I mean, you know, because a lot of times when you go to a hotel because you're there for a certain destination, you actually go to the destination and you don't really get to enjoy the hotel. So I totally get it. Yep. Yeah. I'm, I'm excited for that too. We're going to be posting this all week long, all the different things. We started with boating and that's what we did yesterday. Um, yeah, isn't that what we started? Yeah, with? that's what we started we've yesterday. Got, we've got other activities planned, but I got to show you this, okay? I'm just putting it together. So this is just dates and cashews. That's it. That's all this is, okay? So you understand, yes, it's healthy. Yes, it's healthy sugar, but yes, it's loaded with like healthy sugar and so that's fruits, dried fruit, right? And it's also, sorry, I'm looking, I got to look at IG No, you're too. good. They see you. Um, but yes, it's got... Um, Lots and lots of nuts. So great healthy fat, but understand it's that healthy fat. It's loaded. <laughs> it's a cup and a half of cashews. So yeah. you know what? I'm just gonna point over here. I don't see us over yeah, on it's just can... it's just that the camera's um dimmed out. It's it's there. Okay. So <laughs> I'll believe it. It's all it. good. It's just... Yeah. So anyway, so yeah, so this looks super, super yummy. And so I actually don't know what we're doing, but I know we got you saw some the picture. Cool, I know, but I don't know what we're oh, doing. A lot of times oh. I just like She just says this is what we're doing. Right actually my son Devin, our oldest, he's the one that said, Mom, you gotta try this, it's so good. And I'm like, All right, we will. And I've done other things with dates and, and it's delicious. It's really delicious. But this is that like dessert pizza thing, so this is what we're gonna do. All right, I've got that's the crust is done. By the way, this was put into I no just have bake, to, no nothing. Yeah, I put this in a tart pan and I just sprayed it. I already sprayed it with um, olive oil, and now I'm just gonna place the yogurt on here. So this yogurt is a Plain. honey. <laughs> no, it's a honey yogurt. Honey yogurt from Nancy's. Yo, you can use a plain Greek yogurt um, and you know sweeten it yourself. This was only sweetened by honey, so that's it. Okay, and I and I just I like this one actually, Nancy's brand. I do like it. She makes some organics as well. Um, that's not what I chose, just because I didn't want. Well, I didn't want the flavors that they had. So all I'm gonna do is pour this on here. Just to cover the top. Right. It's like it's a dessert pizza. Have you never had a dessert pizza? I don't remember. So I'm like. It's the first for him too. It's a new thing. <laughs> okay. So hey. Um, but when we're talking about our staycation, the thing about it is, you can see what I'm doing, right? It's not too hard, you just pour it on. And what, oh, I was gonna tell you, my son, what he did was, I'm a little ADD, I go back and forth, so I just <laughs> need to let you know that. One of the things that he did was he actually blended the yogurt with cream cheese. He did like a quarter cup of cream cheese. I'm not going to, um, I don't want it in this, but that's okay, you can if you want to. Um, again, I've got yogurt here, I'm just gonna spread it across, kind of like doing a pizza like with, with a sauce. And then we've got berries, we've got some blueberries and some strawberries that we're gonna garnish it with on the top. Actually, it's not a garnish, it's just it's decorating the it. the meat of it, right? Yeah, it's, well, the whole thing is <laughs> the meat of it. Okay, so we're gonna put that on. And you can put any kind of fruit you want on there. Um, you can do bananas, pineapple, whatever. Sliced peaches. Oh, sliced peaches. That was <laughs> we on. We should have grabbed some of those from Becky yesterday when we were at her oh, house. Yeah. She actually posted, hey, if you want some peaches come from over. her tree, come on over. And we were there, yeah. and I didn't do it. I'm like <laughs> kicking myself because it would have been perfect to have some sliced peaches with the strawberries and, and the blueberries. So Okay, so I'm going to do strawberries. He's going to put the blueberries on. Um, I'm not sure how. Mm. We just put it, man. I'm gonna go around. You go uh, in the middle. 
I was gonna wait till you get some um, okay, on the thing first. Okay, because he, so. he knows. <laughs> <laughs> she, she's gonna we've move been, it if I don't wait. <laughs> we've been married a lot of years, and um, he knows me too well. That I'm like, oh yeah, that was not the right thing to do, right? She's gonna crack whatever I do, so I need to wait. <laughs> okay, so let me let me just say one thing though about okay, not one thing, but let me just explain the thing about um, our staycation is I wanted to make sure that we um, had something that we were doing together. It's not like we didn't go somewhere and do stuff. Do you want me to do that while you talk to them? No. Okay. I can do it. <laughs> I don't know why I can't do that. You can. Um, well, then I lost my train of thought. So, staycation. Yeah. And so, we've gone to Lagoon, we did some things, and, and you know, but the wonderful thing about staycations is that you're close by, you don't have to spend time driving somewhere far away or flying or whatever, and you do it right here, and it actually is pretty economical to do it that way, you know? Because, wait, oh, that's pretty, you did a good job. See, I have my moments. <laughs> you did a good job. <laughs> so, um, okay, well, well, I don't know what else I'm gonna do there. Are you gonna there you that? go. Um, do but the same thing. The, uh, the thing about that I was having was a little bit of mom guilt. Yeah, she so, was. So, um, I don't know if that you guys ever experienced that. Okay, maybe dad guilt, mom guilt, whatever. Dads um, don't have dad guilt. <laughs> Not like you do. He's speaking for all you dads. Yes, I am. Um, but At least was, they don't show it. <laughs> but what I'm saying is that I was like, you know, we, we're, if we're working, working outside the home, a lot of times, or even inside the home, you know, you've got to pay attention to that kind of stuff, right? And you're working and you're doing all that work and and you want to spend time with the kids or those, are, you know, there's just a lot going on. It doesn't even matter if it's summer. It could be any time um, throughout your, you know, while even while they're in school. But I felt a little bit more while we were out of school and um, he and I were discussing the fact that, you know, there's really no need for that kind of guilt because you're trying to support your family. You're trying to help you know, provide and all those kind of things, as well as um, you want to be able to nurture them and do all those things. So, my point is, <laughs> I got to get rid of the guilt. What else? What else is we saying? Well, I think one of the things that you that as we were talking about, she said, "Yeah, I just feel guilty because I'm trying to balance kids in with work and my clients that I'm training and helping on their fitness journey." And she goes, "I feel like I have to make time." She goes, I hate that I have to make time. And I'm like, Make what? time? Yeah, yeah, we were talking about that. You're like, you were saying, you know, I don't like the phrase of making time for something. Oh. And and well, making memories is what I was making saying. Making memories, that's, that's what it was. That's not making time, it was making right. memories. Making memories. And and I think a lot of times, if we're not deliberate and purposefully living, we don't make time for the things that are most important for us. And obviously for me and Judy. The, the most important thing for us is our family. Mm -hmm. and, and I think that's where the mom guilt, and I say, yeah, dads don't have dad guilt, but they do, right? We end up working all the time, and oh, am I making time for the kids? And if you don't go about and purposefully set a time for the things that matter most in life, guess what? They end up getting pushed to the back. And you're like, wow, all of a sudden you wake up, I haven't had, um, any time for my kids or I haven't had time for my wife and so some of the things that we do purposefully is we have date night every Friday night or at least every weekend so we try to make it Friday night but sometimes kids activities make it be Saturday night so we always have a date night because you got to keep the courtship between husband and wife moving that's why we made it 29 and a half years plus her patience with me <laughs> I almost said 25 years. I almost corrected him. <laughs> It'll be 30 in February. Yeah, I got I the rings on my leg to prove it. I know it's 30. <laughs> she doesn't know. She's, she's already forgetting. Anyway. So, <laughs> so but I, I think that's one of the things that we were talking about is, is that, yeah. you know, making memories is important. It was, being yeah. purposeful about that. It's right? because it's because I remember back, gosh, long ago that someone had said, we well, want to make memories. And I thought, well, just live your life and you'll have memories. But I understand now what they were trying to say is that it's not, it's that you need to be purposeful with what you're doing in your life. Just like with purposeful eating, it's the same thing. You don't want to absentmindedly just like grab chips and grab whatever, because then you start putting junk in your body. And well, what you, 
you are what you eat kind of thing because you put junk in your body you're gonna get junk out right you're not gonna get a lot of good fuel not good energy blah, the whole so on and so forth so it's the same kind of thing so be purposeful in what you're doing so that you can make the most of the time and so we are gonna be purposeful with our family so we can make the most time with our family that's right so that's it. And we are gonna enjoy this staycation. And look at this awesome it's dessert. Done. It's okay, done. Well, we need to try it. Oh, we get to try it. Woo! Yeah, well, last I can't wait. So last time, I took a bite too soon, and she wasn't too happy about it. No, so I wasn't this happy. time, I'm, <laughs> oh, I'm making sure I wait till she says. I'm actually wanting to because it's yogurt. It's gonna be kind of a little messy. So let me eat here. I actually think what I would do with this and Stick maybe it what I put it in the fridge for about 15 yeah, minutes. Yeah, but I don't want to. Just to firm up the, the yogurt. We're gonna taste it. So yeah. oh I'm I'm with you, but I am saying normally I would probably do that. So it won't firm up. Yes, That's why it, that oh sorry. Go ahead. Go ahead. That's I was just gonna say she says <laughs> she says looks delicious. I'm like, yes, oh, it, it came, is. It came look, yes. look, it came out together. Ooh. Okay, so um, right. the thing about it is that that's why you're supposed to use Greek yogurt, and I didn't, but we are probably supposed to because it's thicker. Yeah. Okay? All right, we're gonna do this together. So you notice she only grabbed one fork this time? I was gonna get a second one. <laughs> I was gonna get a second right. one for me. So is this your piece or mine? We're sharing. Okay, let's share. Okay. So. Wait, you just like stabbed I my just piece. cut it in half. <laughs> one, two, three. Mm. Oh, good job. I dropped it. Oh, wow, this is super yummy. Mm hmm. Mm. Mm. I like the crust. Mm hmm. Mm. Yeah, this is a thumbs up. If you like yogurt, definitely a good one. So, just so you know, it's not going to be a cream cheesy kind of thing unless you add cream cheese, but this was delicious. You don't need cream cheese. This is perfect. Mm. So, mm. yeah. All right. Super thumbs up. This so. was a good one. Good one, Devin. Thank yep. you for sharing. Thank you, guys. So. Hey, Reed. Yeah. Well, you guys have a great Sunday. We're going to go enjoy our staycation with the kids and each other. And you guys have a great one, and we'll catch you next Sunday. Enjoy. I'll post this recipe. No. All right. Good Thanks stuff. for watching, everybody. See you guys. Thanks, NIG. See ya. Bye. Bye. Well, this is really good. I'm definitely going to get another one of these. <laughs> oh, yeah. I think mm, I Jody, I, I think I have a hard time doing this. That's okay. I'll help you then.